slugs and uh, two days another uh, average in match. Oh, yo, with a uh, Dan Top Deck team again on the channel with uh, a thousand six hundred uh, and sixteen hundred uh, rating. So <laughs> and low BPM with uh, eight hundred rating. So yeah, that's pretty pretty high rated. Um, so let's see what we have uh, here because I'm discovering uh, the, the, the gameplay live with you guys. So um, yeah, I think. Uh, Low BPM Tommy was on uh, Machina value, <laughs> so let's see. And uh, yeah, Dan is uh, as always is on uh, value too. So let's see. So yeah, um, yeah, Dan uh, starts uh, and he has the Dark Refer, so immediately I discard the value and send the Necro Gamma, and then he just set Dust Tornado and Bottomless. So now, Low BPM opened a double Pot of Avari, so you have to make this live. Uh, but uh, yeah, it's unfortunate as the car is for the answer, so let's see. I, I guess you just go for charge and see what uh, what you can find. <laughs> so immediately find Machina Gearframe, Machina Force and Machina Fortress. So yeah, the Fortress is already live. And this will help for the Pot of Avaris. So yeah, he goes for the Lila, but he said the hamster and uh, passed the turn. So now I guess Dan has to go for the Caius, yeah. So banish the hamster, so it's a good trade. Attack directly, no goals. And uh, let's see what's... Oh, and top deck is second Machina for so that's that's pretty good, but you have to play around the, the bottom list. So now, low BPM kind of goes... have to go for the Lila, the, I mean the 50-50, and hope he, he finds the, the bottom list. So let's see. Goes for it. And then, uh, yeah, he has to go for the bottom list. So now you can uh, freely go for the, the Fortress. Special summon it. No, no answers. Uh, clear the Caius. So that's pretty good, and now you have, uh, yeah, we, get, we could get closer to the, um, <laughs> to the game. And here Dan choose to go for um, Necrogamna, and I've, maybe he's thinking he can uh, finish this game quick, like go Brain Control, steal the Machina Fortress, attack with both, you just need one normal summon and uh, that's just game, because low BPM is already pretty, l not that low, but uh, it's enough, so yeah, first to pass is the turn, and yeah, that's just game, like I said, so yeah, Dan from the Armageddon Knight, uh, brain control and uh, yeah, that's just game. So we can go to game number two. It's unfortunate because the low BPM was starting to make a comeback, but uh, he was lacking defensive options. Um, so this time low BPM starts. Yeah, maybe he's just playing Machina. I don't know why he told me it was value. I think he, he, he meant it was value against Machina. So now, um, yeah, just said the hamster. And uh, yeah, I mean, wh whoever said the hamster first is ki kind of winning in this um, matchup. So just at the bottom list. Oh, yeah. Choose to set the dust tornado too. So yeah, playing to heavy storm, but um yeah, Dan goes for Armageddon Knights and the value attack uh, attack over the hamster. Hamster triggers, gets the the Ryko, and uh, yeah, I mean that's the hamster Caius opening, so <laughs> you know who's winning this this one. So yeah, uh, Dan sets everything and uh Lobby PM choose to go for a blind blind dust tornado, okay. Um and top deck the heavy storm. So go for Raiko and uh, snipe another set. So find uh, one of the bottomless and uh, yeah, I mean ag again you just go for Caius now. Caius on the Armageddon Knight, I hope. Yeah, and that's the second bottomless. And uh, just like this, um, low BPM just uh, uh, traded with uh, all three trap cards. And uh, yeah, there's also the follow up with uh, Machina Gearframe. So let's see. So yeah, attack with uh, Amster. And uh, yeah, just was the turn. So now Dan top deck uh, deep prison, which is not that great. But there's the side draw, which could come in clash. But that's the bottom list for it. So yeah, um, go for Sirocco, clear the hamster. Um, oh no, okay. So low BPM choose to use the the bottom list. Um, so Dan choose then to go for the side draw now. Okay, well there's no gear frame, so yeah. So go for it and uh, set the deep prison. This works. Uh, and uh, low BPM just updated like, the Machina Fortress, so you can just go heavy storm and then Machina Gearframe, and uh, yeah, that's just <laughs> that's looking like a warp. Um, so yeah, get, just special summon one fortress. Uh, okay, should he choose to go for the fortress, the Chimera Fortress first, then goes for fortress. Yeah, it just push more damage, I guess, and also yeah. For monsters and uh, yeah, gets him closer to part of Avari. So now Dan has to top deck something insane if he wants to do. But even then, I don't know what he could top deck uh, in this position. Maybe Mirror Force. <laughs> so yeah, top deck Skyus and uh, yeah, we can go to game number three. Um, so yeah, all in all, like 
L'OBPM couldn't do much game number one, Dan couldn't do much game number two, it's pretty uh, one-sided each, uh, each game, so yeah, uh, Dan uh, starts, um, he set the Necrogana and the MST and passed the turn, so now LobbyPM has not much, so yeah, the thing is if you set the Armster, you get cleared by the Rico, you get cleared by the Caius, so that's the thing uh, with this kind of matchup, so yeah, he set the Plague to bait out and set the Dust Tornado and pass the turn. So the Tornado tried with MST, and the op uh, Dan doesn't have the Caius this time, so uh, can go for Card Trooper. Uh, so now you know there's no Caius, so you kinda, you're kind of kind of safe to set the, the Amster. Um, so, yeah, set you now Ghost or Charge of the Light Brigade. Uh, so the meals are horrendous. And uh, what do you get? Do you get the Lagda? Yeah, you go for the Lagda. Set the Amster, set the, the Tornado, and trying to make the Lila live for next turn. Uh, unfortunate, but Dan can uh, meal with a uh, trooper a uh, second time. Um, doesn't get much, but uh, I mean, uh, it will, it will, uh, it will get the value. Then goes uh, Dark Refer, discard one value, send uh, one Sirocco. So yeah, the Dan is uh, controlling the the game state for now. Uh, goes for the arm wing. Uh, that's fine. And uh, yeah, the, you see, you see this deck death, and how much it will, it won't do anything on the hands of low BPM. But uh, yeah, so attack with the arm wing on the sets. I'm sorry, I guess the Raiko. Oh, attack declaration. He wants to go for the for the deck dev. Okay. So yeah, use the deck dev on the armed wing uh, straight up. The, the don't waste the battle phase and uh, see the hand, which doesn't do much. But then you can attack directly with uh, both monsters and uh, yeah, low BPM has to make something happen or he's just gonna lose the lose the match. Um, so yeah, top deck the gear frame. Um, so pretty insane top decks. Um, can use uh, can use the, the effect, get a fortress, and uh, no, yeah, it's kind kind of back in the game. So yeah, this got one force gets a uh, fortress on the gets fortress live on the field, and uh, yeah, now you have to try and clear. So clear the clear the dark refer, or at least try to to clear the dark refer. It works. Then clear the clear the guard trooper. Um, and now, yeah, equipped. Uh, I don't know if you have to go for gear frame equip fortress because you're big losing on uh, Caius. But at the same time, yeah, I mean it protects you from the Raiko. But I think if, if it was the Raiko, the the set monster would have been flipped already. So let's see. Um, yeah, so top deck the Armageddon Knight. So <laughs> it's all about the monsters. This the tornado is not doing anything. And uh, Dan goes for. For Armageddon Knights, and what does he send? Does he send the plague? Yeah, it goes for the plague. Then use its effects, stack up Sidra, and then makes a uh, makes oh Bryonac. Yeah, I mean that's cool because uh, you can discard anything; it doesn't matter. So yeah, um, bounce the set, which is totally fine. You don't uh, you don't mind. Then bounce uh, the fortress, which again is uh, fine and then uh, yeah you can just use the grave and uh, go for the finish so unfortunate that uh, low bpm didn't have uh, the gores or track or anything to to protect himself and uh, dan just from the from the, the from the little uh, from the damage enough uh, to finish the game so yeah that's it for for this uh, match i don't know let us know guys uh, in the comments but i don't know if uh, any of the players could have uh, played it better but i think yeah um, yeah, low BPM couldn't have won this one. I mean, he was just lacking defensive options, and uh, yeah, there was too much gas from uh, from Dan. So yeah, uh, that's it for the gameplay. I hope you guys liked this one, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.